what's up YouTube so today's video I was planning on uploading the newest episode of the super awesome game review show that was supposed to be what I was gonna do today but that's gonna be shown a little later because of uh, basically the news that just broke recently and that is the fact that Scalebound has been cancelled for the Xbox One so yeah that was a game that a lot of Xbox people were looking forward to and a lot of people were waiting for that game to come out and they're probably gonna buy an Xbox because of that game but now it looks like uh, that is not gonna happen so as Microsoft has confirmed that the game has been cancelled at least I think for the Xbox One they didn't really go into any other detail but anything like that as far as I know Maybe more information came out by the time this video was done, I don't know, but yeah, so it's looking like Scalebound got cancelled for the Xbox One. And, uh, yeah, that fucking sucks, actually, because I was looking for this game, as I'm sure a lot of people who owned Xboxes also were. So, uh, yeah, however, I will say this, I don't think this is the end of the game, like, at all. Um, this game might actually, I, I still think it'll go somewhere, and I think it might end up on the Nintendo Switch, because this has happened before, where a game got cancelled and then ended up on on the Nintendo system. Uh, you all remember Devil's Third? Yeah, okay, so that, that might be a bad example, but it's the only one I have for the time being. Unless you want to call Bayonetta 2, but then again, with Bayonetta 2, it just wasn't going to happen at all. Nintendo's the one that funded that. It's not like it was going to be on one system and then, like, dropped completely. It just wouldn't happen. But this is a bit different, but kind of a similar situation where the game might actually end up coming out for another system. I mean, it could go to PS4. It could still be on PC. I don't know. But it looks like it's just not ending up on the Xbox One at any point in time. That is over and done with. And that really sucks, so, uh, yeah, that, that's kind of fucked up. Hopefully this game does, however, get saved and put to another system, and if it ends up on PS4, well, I guess I'm going to go get a PS4 and play it, I don't know. Or, but, like, I still think this is going to end up on the Switch, because, basically, you know, the guy from Platinum, Camille, whatever his name, he, he always saying how much he just loves Nintendo, and even though there's a lot of games that came out from Platinum Games that didn't end up on the Wii U... But that might have been more Activision than Platinum, I don't know, but it's just one way to look at it. Because the last couple of games were Activision games that Activision themselves didn't even advertise because they weren't, uh, like, fucking Call of Duty. If it's not Call of Duty, Activision just doesn't seem to want to fucking, um, advertise it. But, yeah, so the Ninja Turtles game and, and Star Wars, Star Wars, I say Star Wars, Transformers, I have no idea how I mix those two fucking things up. <laughs> did not go to the Wii U, but they were Platinum games. So, yeah. Just uh, a little something to think about. It absolutely sucks this game's coming to the Xbox One. Although, to be honest with you, and I will say this, even though the game was coming to the Xbox One, I don't think a lot of people were going to buy it, especially like the Xbox guys. Yeah, you know, they're going to hype it up like they do all their games, but I'm pretty sure at the last minute, they would find some reason, like every other Xbox game, find some reason to not play it, buy it, or they just cancel the pre-order for something like that. But hopefully... I think this game will find new life on the Xbox, not not on the Xbox, on the on the Switch, and I think you're gonna see that announcement sometime around E3. I don't think they're gonna mention it at the uh, Nintendo Switch reveal coming up in a few days because, uh, well, I, I, that'd be like a very last minute thing. And I think I'm pretty sure that presentation is probably already over and done with. You know, they have it all recorded and edited. They're just waiting for the day to put it up. Or whatever. Unless it's gonna be live. I don't, I don't fucking know if it's live or not. But I'm pretty sure they already have planned what they're gonna talk about. And if this game is in fact gonna end up on another system, whether it be PS4 or Switch, I think we're gonna see that announcement at the ne at the next E3 coming up a little later this year. So uh, yeah, I think it's gonna happen there. I don't think this game is actually dead and buried yet. I could be wrong. I don't know, but I have a feeling that we will see it come out for another system or be announced to come out for another system, but. W what year it'll come out, I don't know. It might not come out until 2018 at this point, depending on what they gotta do, and how far they were into the game before it was actually cancelled. So, uh, yeah, there you go. So, for those of you looking for, for, for those of us looking forward to this game, uh, we are kind of really pissed off and disappointed now, but for those of you who think it might end up someplace else, hold out hope. You don't know. None of us know, but we might see this game 
come back to life very soon. Just on a different system. So, yeah. That's all I want to say about that, and I will see you guys next time.